Welcome back guys to the Porto career mode and today we have Chavez. Chavez in the final I believe it is I don't know if it's the final or not but of the Portuguese League Cup I believe it is the final and Maritmo guys and on the side note from this what I just saw look at this check this out my dudes Motinho Yes, Joao Moutinho, ex-Porto player, says he wants to go home and he is Portuguese, played for Porto. So, I mean, if this speculation continues that he wants to come home, hey, with open arms, my dudes. And today, uh, since we basically have the league in our lap, guys, there's six games left, two episodes left of this year. We are leading by 10 points currently right now, but with a game at hand, so that could possibly go to 13. Um, I'm gonna try out a different squad. Look, check this out. Well, it's the same squad, just different formation. Three men back, three, four, one, two. Uh, I think we could rock this. If not, I'll go ahead and change it back to our default. There'd be no problem there. I'm leaving all our boys that could play uh, in the four men back here. So just in case we run into problems, we just switch back. But for now, guys, let's go into the game against Chavez, test out our new formation. I'll see you guys on the field. Uh, the reason I like this five, four man in the back is because of all the people in the middle. So it, it makes it hard for the other opposition to attack through the middle. And let's see. Oh, my God. Taken down in the penalty box. That is a penalty. Uh, I like the three men in the back, the three, four, one, two, because so much of our players are in the middle that they have to go to the wings and cross it in and when they cross it in there's three center backs in the box so there's really nowhere to go and uh chavez gives a penalty over suarez here and of course it is raining so let's see can we yes we do suarez with his 24th or 25th goal of the season has been an amazing first season for him under me and i really plan on making him that much better next year he is 80 rated i wish he would go up more and if he had a four star skill move, four star skill move trait, he would have been perfect. But he only has three, which I mean, it hasn't affected us at all. He's been great, great this season. Uh, let's go ahead and continue our game. Uh, one no, seventh minute. All right, great pass. Can Bruma? Yeah, Bruma's got that pace. Bruma's got that pace, though. And Bruma playing as a second striker makes it happen. Great pass over Suarez. That's why I put Bruma and Suarez instead of uh, Suarez and Tecatito. Because Bruma has that crazy pace where he could just get behind defenders and get those over the head balls. And right there it showed that he still has great finishing. I have been training him all season long to get to have good finishing. So right there, perfect uh, both of our forwards have now scored in this formation and we've been defending pretty well so far I mean they haven't gotten to us they haven't made too much danger for us but let's see let's keep it going usually I could tell when a uh, formation is gonna work within like the first half and for now it seems to be working pretty good All right, great pass by Suarez to little Robbie. Let's see, can we do something else here? Oh, Bruma, Bruma, Bruma just outpacing. Bruma just outpacing. What a great left foot he has on him. That's That was a good move. I just kind of let the defender get flat-footed in front of me after the through pass. Look at that. And then went straight to his left. He has no one, no one is going to catch up to Bruma. He's got 90s pace and acceleration and the Chavez goalkeeper does not react to it. Guys, 3-0 in the first half. This could be the start of something great with this formation if we keep it going this way. All right, great job by Suarez. Great job by Bruma. Bruma turning on the Jets, turning on the Jets. Oh, can we? Suarez with his second goal of the day and uh, it was a good one. It should have been Bruma's second goal of the day. Keeper blocks it. Suarez follows in. Guys, this formation is crazy for us. Now, will it be this good for us next year? Probably not. Why? We're going to up the sliders. So we're going to make the CPU players a lot better. We're going to better their touch, their shooting accuracy, 
uh, their possession of the ball. So expect them to get a lot tougher. Expect a lot more narrower games. We're not going to get a lot of these 4-0 games next year. But we still, hopefully, will be playing well. Uh, great job by Bruma, dude. Bruma, 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 Bruma with the second. Bruma is, oh my god, I, I cannot sing enough praises about Bruma and Suarez, man. They are crazy in the attack together. That was a beautiful run by Geraldis to move the defender over, give the lane to Bruma, and Bruma tucks it away. He's been nothing but great for us. Uh, I don't want to say he's the best signing we've had. I would think that Anthony Lopez is, but Bruma is definitely a quick right behind second place in that uh category guys five nil nine goals in the league he has been playing as winger but right now we will keep on playing him as striker hopefully we can get him into double digits and even better get him into that 15 16 range uh suarez i hope to get all the way up to 30 but we will see what happens bruma with the ball again ah bruma's pass does not come off and this should be it. They should call it right here. And that is it, guys. 5-0 win with the new formation. 3-4-1-2. Terrific game played by our boys. Bruma and Suarez up top is definitely going to be a thing the rest of this season. Uh, Tecatito as a cam. I didn't really get to... I didn't really see if he played all that much. Did Bruma get a hat trick? Bruma got a hat trick, bros. What the heck? I thought, no, Suarez hit a penalty and Suarez came in with a sliding goal. What the hell? How did Bruma get a hat trick? Oh, I guess, what the frick? I guess he got a hat trick. Oh my lord. How do I not know uh, all that I scored? Guys, 5-0. Great game. Uh, hopefully, Jota works out in this formation the way that Suarez and Bruma did. For now, guys, let's keep it going. We have Tondela next. I believe it is in the final of the Portuguese League Cup. If not, it is the semi-final second leg then. So let's go ahead and jump into that game. Well, actually, first, let's check what game it is because we need to know. We want to know. Oh, it is the semi-final. And it's against Chavez again. So uh, we just gave him a beating. So expect nothing less from us. Guys, I'll see you on the field. All right, guys. And once again, we're back in Portugal. It is raining, guys. I mean, Jesus Christ, bros. I can't believe that it has rained probably like 80% of our games here. I mean, we already are 4-1 uh, aggregate on this game. So really, to tell you the truth, we don't. I mean, unless they beat us 4-0, we are through and done with this. So let's go ahead and keep on playing as well as we have and see if this formation was not just a one-time thing. Wow. This, I love the way our center backs are playing this. I might have spoken too soon, but no. Awaziem knows exactly what to do here. And just like that, our 19-year-old center back is able to take the ball away from the Chavez man. And we are on the counter. Let's see. What can we do? I see Bruma. I see Bruma making a run. I see Bruma making a run. Bruma getting chased, but can they? Can they? Oh, he jumps on the ball, hits the post. Hits the post. Ah, let's see. Draw this is there. Draw this with the first time shot. No. Blocked. And guys, Chavez come out without a scratch, man. Just hitting the post is Jota, but not enough. And that is half, guys. We have hit the post a couple of times now. We need to play better. We have been playing pretty good. This 3-4-1-2 formation has really worked for us. But as you can see, guys, zero shots on target, seven shots total. But we, we've hit the post a couple of times. But those shots don't count as on target for some reason because we hit the frame instead of the net or the goalie. So, guys, jump into the second half and see if we can get another. We can get a goal or two. Those through balls are not going to be as effective as I would want them to be. Let's see. Andre, Andre with the loss. <laughs> missing just wide. God. We are getting close. We are definitely knocking on the door. Look at that beautiful left-footed strike just a tad bit wide. Andre Andre does not get his goal for right now. Oh, great job by Andre Andre. Can we get this ball to Jota? Beautiful pass. Beautiful pass. Oh, no. Oh, oh. what a beautiful pass. Come on. Patricia! Oh, just over the bar, Danilo Pereira. 
All right, guys, 15 minutes to go. Let's go ahead and make some substitutions. That Nilo, what a shot that would have been. Layun is a bit tired, and right now we need attack. So I'm going to bring Thavi over to that left mid position. I know he's not as defensive as we would want him to be, but he will have to do for right now. Let's also bring on someone else. Let's see. I'm going to bring on Suarez for Geraldes. I'm going to drop Jota to that camp. Let's see if Jota can perform better as a camp than he can as a striker for now. I mean, obviously, last 15 minutes, he could get a lucky touch and end up giving an assist. But, guys, let's finish this game. Let's see if we can get one last attack going. And here comes Tavi. Tavi is fresh, so them legs can run. Oh, my God. Jota. Jota to Suarez and there it is guys 90th minute winner I mean it's not like we weren't gonna win they didn't score the four goals but great job and just like I said Jota could give the assist and guys he gives the assist and to none other than the boy Suarez who we just brought on guys 1-0 5-1 aggregate but guys we go on to the final it's not like they were gonna score the four goals on us anyways but guys great job from our boys to get it right there at the end and there it is guys we take this game 1-0 the full series on 5-1 aggregate ah, man that was crazy and we move on to our last game which is against Maritmo this time we did check in the first part of the game guys two shots for them two on target 12 shots for us only two on target we get the goal though 5-1 aggregate and let's see who we will be playing in the final uh i don't know if they already know who our team's gonna be but it looks like it's gonna be nacional of madeira so guys there it is madeira versus porto in the portuguese league cup final um that's surprising really to tell you the truth with teams like sporting braga benfica who we've got to paired up against uh that nacional is the one that gets through guys on to our next game in the Portuguese league though. All right guys, final match against Maritmo. Oh, man, I hate them shadows, bros. But it's here and uh, we're having Tavi play at the cam instead of Tecatito because uh, little Robbie was tired playing on the right side of this four man uh, mid. Um, so I gave the start to uh, Tecatito at the position that Robbie usually plays at and Tavi is playing at cam so let's hope that he could play that also Hernani is coming in for Bruma at the second striker position so let's see if that plays out as well ah okay okay not the worst ah come on oh no Hernani was there uh, we could have had a chance right there Referee calls half guys nil nil, but we have had plenty of chances as you can see five shots two on target Suarez hitting the post ones and then getting his shot blocked Second time by the goalkeeper. Let's jump into the second half see if we can get a lead going because There's only four games left guys five games if you include the final with uh, uh, Who is it Nacional? For the Portuguese League Cup. Let's go ahead and jump into the second half Great job by Boli, and unfortunately, oh, okay, something, we can do something here, we can do something here, we can do something, <laughs> golasso by Ali, golasso by Ali, wow, that was a great, they try to clear it, only falls to Maxi, Maxi does a 1-2 with Davi, no, Ali does a 1-2 with Davi after Maxi's initial pass, and he puts it away, what a rocket shot to the opposite corner of the keeper, Keeper could not do anything. His sight was blocked and Ali's shot was a rocket. And we get the 1-0, guys, after 55 minutes. Great little uh, passing by our boys. And we leave the game now. Ah, oh, man. I was looking for Ali. Ali was un, uh, unchecked in that outside. Let's see. What can we do here? Okay, Ali. Ali is running at them now with a lot of space and a lot of options. Great pass to Davi. Can he? Davi gives Ali an assist and now Ali gives Davi the assist, guys. 2-0 in a matter of 6 minutes. We double our lead. Ah, guys, this is, this is beautiful. A lot of young players on this side and they are clicking. I can't wait to see how they progress and grow up together and become uh, just a terrific team uh, together 
you know 2-0 62 minutes guys 28 minutes to go and another through ball to Zainadin the boy who uh, fouled our guy earlier let's see come on Ramos making a nice run passes it to Suarez I see Bruma I see Bruma yep the broom is loose let's go let's go Bruma with the golazo Bruma with the golazo no one closes him down and I'm gonna use that speed all day guys counter attack football at its finest we just we're gonna use Bruma's pace all day and they give him too much room guys I wanted to sweat it no one pressed they all stayed with their man in the back so might as well take care of that give Bruma a goal he just came in and he scores for us he's been doing great under this two uh, forward um, two forward formation he, Bruma's been doing great under our two forward formation and that's why I want him to stay at the club hopefully we can keep him happy because we know that players want bigger wages and whatnot and hopefully he stays with us Hernani let's see back to Suarez 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 maybe Hernani should be playing on the mid on the outside of the mid instead of playing forward that was a good job by Hernani great touch by Suarez to get the ball around his defender who pressured him and great shot guys we double our lead in the last uh, two minutes of the game now 4-0 and that is gonna be it guys great job by our boys I'm loving I'm digging this 3-4-1-2 formation and um, that's gonna be it for this episode let's go ahead and take a look at the league table let's see who's behind us who will be joining us next year in the Champions League alright guys so we have a 16 point lead with three games to go that is it we are champions of Portugal without a doubt um, Benfica is definitely going to come in second place because they have a 17 point lead on Sporting and Braga and Sporting are still fighting out for that third place spot. So is Guimarães to tell the truth. But top three uh, spots get champions, next two get Europa. We'll see what happens guys. That's going to be it for this episode. Remember to leave a like, subscribe, share and until next time guys, see you later.